Have you ever looked out of your window and wondered what would happen if one of these stars exploded? Scientists have recently made a terrifying discovery in space with the help of the James Webb Space Telescope. Approximately 1.3 light years away from Earth, the giant red star named Betelgeuse is probably about to say goodbye to its once bright existence. The star located in the Orion constellation might experience an explosive supernova, which means the star's life cycle will eventually come to an end. Betelgeuse was once the brightest star we could see from Earth, but it seems like this is coming to an end very soon. In 2019, astronomers observed something they called a stellar evolution in real time, a new phenomena that no one had ever seen before. With the help of the Hubble telescope, astronomers were the first to experience the senior star blowing off a huge part of its surface. After the explosion, the Betelgeuse had dimmed in its brightness so much that even backyard stargazers were questioning if the star had begun to die. Betelgeuse could be on the edge of experiencing something that mankind has never experienced in the history of space exploration. Are you ready to explore the groundbreaking event that Betelgeuse is about to experience? Make sure you are prepared for the worst as this space news is about to knock you off your feet. Can you already guess what's about to happen to the Betelgeuse star? Let us know down in the comments. So what is it that the Betelgeuse actually is? The twinkling spot of light, Betelgeuse, or as some of you may know it, Alpha Orion, is the second brightest star in the constellation of Orion. Its name is derived from the Arabic term Bat al-Jawaza, which is translated as the giant's shoulder. This is referring to the place it is located in in the Orion constellation as the star is marking the eastern shoulder of the formation. Seen from Earth, the Betelgeuse is one of the most luminous stars in the night sky. Betelgeuse is a red supergiant star, which is approximately 1,400 times as large as our own sun. This could be compared to a grain of salt next to a basketball. The star is located in the Orion constellation, which is named after the Greek mythological hunter. Under astronomers, the Orion is one of the most conspicuous constellations out there, which contains many of the brightest stars in the universe. Besides the Betelgeuse star, the constellation is also the home of other well-known stars, such as the Rigel, which is located in the constellation's leg, and the Bellatrix. The Milky Way counts around 200 red giant superstars. The Betelgeuse, though, might be known as the most famous star of them all. With a surface temperature of 3600 degrees Kelvin, it is slightly cooler than the surface of our own Sun, which has a temperature of around 5800 degrees Kelvin. Even though the star is cooler than our sun, it is illuminating 126,000 times the light. The size difference might be one of the most obvious explanations, as the Betelgeuse is around 1,400 times larger than our star. In comparison to our own sun, the Betelgeuse is quite a young appearance, with its date of birth only 10 million years ago. It still is the oldest star in the Orion constellation. However, this massive star is expected to reach the last stages of its life very soon and become a supernova. But sir, what exactly is a supernova? Simply explained, a supernova can be described as the biggest explosion that humans have ever seen. A blast of a supernova is the extremely bright and super powerful explosion of a star. A supernova could be caused by the last hurrah of a dying massive star, for this to happen, the star in question has to be at least five times the size of our own sun. A supernova on a star like this is producing a fantastic bang. Do you know any other famous supernova events from the past? Let us know down in the comments. Stars are fueled by an enormous amount of nuclear matter at their cores. You understand this is producing tons of energy which is making the center very hot. This heat creates pressure which is needed to keep the star from collapsing. The reason why is that a star is a balance between two forces. One force is coming from the core, which is created by the nuclear fuel burning inside of the star. On the other side, the star is squeezed by gravity, which is trying to keep the star as small as possible. This outward push is resisting the inward squeeze of gravity, which is creating the perfect balance. When one of these massive stars runs out of fuel, it cools off. And when it cools off, that means the pressure coming from the inside is dropping. And when the pressure drops, gravity wins the game, which means that a massive star like Betelgeuse 
suddenly collapses. Can you imagine something a million times the mass of the Earth collapsing in just 15 seconds? A collapse happens so quickly that an enormous shock wave causes an explosion of the outer part of the star. An exploding Betelgeuse would be an easy task to spot from Earth, even with the naked eye. The only thing left behind would be one of the densest objects in the universe, a black hole. Betelgeuse turning into a supernova would be a disastrous event. But what does this mean for Earth? As the Orion constellation is around 1,344 light-years away from Earth, it is most likely that we are not able to hear anything exploding if the Betelgeuse goes supernova. Still, this does not mean that we are not able to notice any difference. As mentioned before, an exploding Betelgeuse would be visible with the naked eye from Earth, appearing as a very bright star. However, due to the distance between Earth and the Orion constellation, the explosion would take several hundred years before it finally reaches Earth. The chances are very likely that the light from the explosion would be faded by that time. However, radiation could form a potential danger. As Betelgeuse is internally fueled with nuclear materials, a high amount of deadly radiation is spread once the star goes supernova. This radiation could harm the Earth's atmosphere and potentially our climate. This could result in climate change, the increase of natural disasters on Earth, and could potentially even make some parts of the Earth completely uninhabitable. In conclusion, when will the explosion of Betelgeuse happen? Could be tomorrow, could be next year, but it could also be that we will never experience this in our lifetime. Are we safe on Earth if Betelgeuse goes supernova? Probably, yes. Earth is so far away from the Betelgeuse that an explosion will not kill us anyway. Instead of worrying about its explosion, we should just enjoy every second of the massive red star while it's still out there. The universe is such a beautiful place, but sometimes we seem to forget that also beautiful things can come to an end. Enjoy these while you can.